I'm playing Riff in West Side Story. Um, he is the leader of the Jets. Um, his role is to make sure that everybody feels um, like a team and that the energy is high because this show is about is all about um, teenage angst and, and he's the prime character of that. I've done a lot of amateur theatre before. This is my first um, professional role and it's very daunting and the fact that it's West Side Story and I'm also playing a lead role is insane but it's I could not have asked for anything better. Hi, I'm Todd Jacobson and I play Tony, the uh, all-American optimist in West Side Story. Hi, I'm Sophie and I play Maria. Um, Maria is a young, naive girl that's recently come to America and just wants to explore and and have fun. It's incredible. It gives the show a truth and a realism that I don't think people have seen before with West Side Story. It, you know, to have so sorry to have 16 year olds we have a few 16 year olds you know and people who are that age playing the actual age of these people in the show all of a sudden all these emotions feel so real and it, uh, it makes a difference most definitely my favorite part of being in this show is is being around so many amazing people um i get to work with people who have been on stage for the last five years or even longer and and i'm completely new to this and and it's amazing getting to learn things from everyone for me, I actually played the, oh, I understudied the role of Maria when I was in high school 10 years ago. Um, so I already had a little bit of experience getting to know the character and, and to having watched the, the lady who played Maria when I was in high school, I sort of learned a lot then too. Um, but I guess when I found out that I got the role in this production, my first reaction was just immediately freaking out. Couldn't believe that I actually got it. And, you know, I went back to watching the movie and then I went and looked at videos of the current Maria that's on Broadway. And, and yeah, but for me, I really, I didn't do too much research because I wanted to make the character my own and bring a little bit of myself to the character. Um, I think for me growing up, that movie was like a household staple. Watching that as a kid, it was just so amazing. It's such a classic. And for me, like as a young boy, to be seeing guys dancing, like that was cool. And that wasn't a normal thing, you know what I mean? So that was really, really cool. I um, mean, I think since getting the job, I've just tried to immerse myself in so much West Side Story history as I can. And thankfully, the show is so old that there is just so much to pull from. So you kind of want to steal all the best bits from every Tony I've ever seen and then just make it your own. I'm a singer. All, all the way and an actor. Um, I've only been dancing for six, six years. Um, so being here and playing like one of the lead dance roles is, is insane. But, um, but uh, you know, you can't, you can't pick, like everything works perfectly with each other and especially in this show. Mine definitely has to be the singing, singing first. I am not a triple threat at all. My dancing is Pretty mediocre. <laughs> we Thankfully, we don't have to really dance that much in the show. That's left to all the other professionals. We just get the emotional pull of the show and we get to sing some of the most beautiful music ever written for musical theatre. West Side Story brings up a lot of very, very serious issues. Um, all the way, th straight away from the beginning, right until the end, it doesn't stop with, with really important messages. And the messages of the show are exactly the same back in the 1950s to what they are now. We are still dealing with the exact same issues and so it's so important that people see it because, you know, it, it, it's what, theatre is what helps people change their mind because it's a biased perspective. Even though the show was written in 1957, unfortunately the show is still so relevant today just because of all the social themes that it deals with in regards to racism and it's something that we're still experiencing now. Um, it's sad but it's it's the reality and I think people who are our age and younger can see this story happening on stage and realise, oh this is something that's still happening these days and to have characters like Tony and Maria be the glimmer of hope in that all that horrible stuff that's going on, I think they can relate to that and go, well at least there's something that can kind of push through those barriers.